I've always prided myself on my ability to make people laugh with my body. Even as a kid, I always gravitated to comedians like Buster Keaton, Charlie Chaplin, or Jim Carrey. I guess I just think physical comedy is the best kind of comedy. The laugh you get from a physical guy, it, it comes right from the gut. It bursts out of you. You have no control over it. And you know, with a physical gag, a farmer in Budapest and a midwife in St. Louis both find it funny. You know, Judd Apatow can't say that. They hate him in Budapest. People often ask me, John, how are you so great at physical comedy? <laughs> These people don't understand. I don't just turn it off when I'm not performing. You know, in order to be a truly great physical comedian, you have to live your life like a physical comedian. And that can be hard. I mean, it is exhausting constantly looking for ways to make people laugh. But in uncertain times like these, what I do is more important than ever. Whether it's doing a silly walk, having difficulty getting out of a car, having difficulty getting into a car, tripping on something unexpectedly, or just having trouble putting on a pair of pants. John, come on, we're gonna be late. Yep, yeah, just give me one second. John. Wait, come on. There's so many ways to get that laugh. And it's up to me, as a comedian, to explore all those avenues. I guess it's my burden. You know, and does it create problems? Absolutely. I mean, I've ruined relationships. My friends have stopped speaking to me. I even killed a guy. But I like to think it's all been worth it. At the end of the day, I'm making people laugh. Isn't that what comedy's all about? <laughs>